Shalom, Shalom. We the Hebrew Israelites. We call week in and week out. We prophesy the downfall of America. And we're going to lost ships of Israel. Go back to the 12 tribes with the so-called Negroes, Native American Indian, and so-called Latino Spanish. So with all that, we want to give our honor and praise and glory to Yahweh, Yahweh, Double honor and blessing to the elders, the apostle of Great Millstone. The water Yahweh, 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 for the elders, the apostle on down, for working those up. To the wisdom and the truth understanding. The spirit of Yahweh, 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 Shalom to the true Akim, the brothers who put in the truth. It's sincerely across the four corners of the earth where we might be scattered abroad along with the confusion of the face that look like the other nation. And Shalom to the true Akim, I believe as well, me and the sisters, the one who repent and come back to Yahweh by Shemiah as well. With that, we're going to say Shalom. Shalom. All right, what we're getting into today is going into uh, the pagan holiday, going to Christmas. Because as you as you can see, when you go into the, uh, when they go into what, December the 25th, who the one who they it recalled Jesus, true name Yahweh Shai. That's the Lord name in Hebrew, Yahweh Shai. Right. They didn't spell with the letter J E O U or V. You know, and that's not part of the Hebrew alphabet. But when you go into it, the Lord wasn't born on December the 25th. You'll never read in the Bible that the Lord was born on Christmas Day. There's no way you can read the Bible from front to back. I don't care how you read it, front to back, back to front. You'll never see that nowhere in there that the Lord was born on December the 25th. Anything, the Lord was born during the wet springtime. So, but. And that's right one right there, because you're not going to find that anywhere in the Bible, no December 25th, right? So, if we finna go until that, the Bible proved that we aren't supposed to rush them and celebrate no big out Thanksgiving, with Thanksgiving, Christmas, uh, Easter, you aren't supposed to celebrate no no big holiday. No, not part of the Lord of High Holy Day, right? But this Jeremiah, chapter 10, what well, I'm starting now, verse 3, yeah, Jeremiah 10 to 3. Right, Jeremiah 10 and 1. It say, Hear ye the word which the Lord has spoken unto you, O house of Israel. See, the Lord only dealing with the Israelite. So called Nick Rose, Native American Indian, the so called Latino Hispanic. Those the Lord chose the people according to the Bible. So the Lord said, He's speaking to you. To the point, the Lord not speaking to everybody according to the Bible. Right? And it say, Thus say the Lord, Yahweh, learn not the way of the heathen. It say, And be not dismayed at the sign of heaven, for the heathen are dismayed at them. And it said, follow not the ways of the heathen. And when you go into, um, what it is, Psalms 104, and I think, see, or see, the 104. You can bring it out. It's going to tell you they learned the works of the heathen, but the Lord say, follow not the ways of the heathen. See, we've been the people all the way that going the opposite way of the Lord told us to go. Matter of fact, you yeah, bring it out. I'm going to try Psalm 104 and see. And let me see what you got right there. Those covers in the deep. Now go to 6 and 4 then. 106 and 4? Yeah, 106 and 4. Remember me, O Lord, with the favor that thou bearest unto thy people. Oh, matter of fact, it's like, it's like a song 106 and um, start from, you can start from 33. It's the book of Psalms 106, verse 33. Because they provoke. His spirit, so that he spake unadvisedly with his lips. And that means rule, so right. During the time, hey, with all uh, Israelites, the Lord looking out for them doing favor, and they still going off. We had men like, hey, what the hell is y'all doing? You know, they still going off. And he said he spoke on the violence, so that means he spoke rule, right? So that means he didn't speak with no soft word. You go get the definition of the word, it's all he spoke rule. Go ahead, up. Uh. Verse 34. They did not destroy the nations. Concerning whom the Lord Yahweh commanded them, but were mingled among the heathen mm. and learned their words. Woo! And they just like today, we mingled among the heathen, and what we do, we learn their words. We learn it by that what December twenty fifth is supposed to be uh, the day Yahweh Shah was born, who they call Jesus. But when you go in reality, the Lord wasn't born on the December twenty fifth. But we learn they pagan, we learn they pagan holiday, man. Which when you go back to Christmas, that's a, a, a wicked uh, origin of. Uh, that, that day, you know, everything was wicked according to me. Um, like you go back to Christmas, we can do the history of all that with the uh, the decoration of the Christmas tree. You know, everything had a meaning to it. Just like Thanksgiving. Everything, right. like with the foods and all that, had a meaning to it, bro. But the same thing, what they were doing back then. Now, you can say something. I must add on that, you know, that's, that's a heavy thing, right? So, um, when we go into that Christmas thing, right? Like you said, it's, it's deep origins to it, man. Like the Timberland boots, right? The big oak yep. tree that's on your boots. You know what I'm saying? The oak tree was symbolizing, you know, Jake was on those trees, man. Right? Being hung. 
right. You know, they, they cover it up, like I said, you they know. Did. They cover it, you know, so they don't want, you know, they try to keep everything, I guess, at peace. Don't keep it dumb down. They don't know what actually happened, you know, prior to y'all getting over or even while y'all was getting over here. You know, right. that, uh, like you said, hey, we was actually home from those trees, man. Done. Like, why you, like, why would you want to well shoot? With an oak tree on it, they were hanging from an oak tree. That okay. don't even make sense. And that's heavy up north. Come on, man. And, and that's the point. The, 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 nah, go ahead. No, I was going to say, in them up north folks, man, they be the one talking about they got all the knowledge and yo, you know, I got all the wisdom and stuff and trying to talk all blackish, you know what I'm saying, with the pro black shit. You know, you know what I'm saying? Shit. Yeah, you know, and y'all be, oh, we got y'all people from down south, but they dumb in here. You know what I'm saying? Y'all, But y'all wearing goddamn boots from Esau when he was hanging, you know what I'm saying? Israel on the on, 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 on tree, man. Man, they just show you how it But they just, both had a wisdom, though. They just show you how we'll follow anything. Right, you know what I'm saying? Dress it up and give it to them. Right, oh, fuck, I got it. Uh, I'm going to turn it down. 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 Yeah, okay. This, uh, this, uh, Proverbs 3 and 31. Envy thou not the oppressor, and choose none of his ways. Hey, man, so... That's the same thing going into, you know what I'm saying, this Christmas, killer Christmas spirit, man. You know what I'm saying? We don't supposed to envy the oppressor, man. Mm. Okay, you know what I'm saying? That, he saw the, the, he's an oppressor, and this this is his thing, man. But as Israel, man, we don't supposed to be following it, man. I'm going to keep on reading on it. So he say, I'm going to read it back. Envy thou not the oppressor, and choose none of his ways. 32. For the forward is abomination. To the Lord Yahweh, but his secret is with the righteous. And that's why we doing what we doing while we out here, man. You know what I'm saying? On, on, on this Christmas week. You know what I'm saying? Because we, we ain't studying about no Christmas, man. We studying about getting the hell up out of here, man. And you ain't doing that but going broke for some kids. Right. And have some kids hard-headed in here. Yeah, right. Listen. But matter of fact, last night, <laughs> I was, you know what I'm saying, working. Keisha, you know what I'm saying? I opened one of my, one of my stops. Mm -hmm. Keisha was like, I don't want to broke behind me, kids. Tell me, bro. But it's like, you do this shit during the whole, you know what I'm saying? You do this shit throughout the whole year by your kids guilty. You know, but since this man has set up a, uh, a holiday, a holy day, a holiday, a holiday, right? And people are like, they going broke behind me. That is like, but things kill them, right? What happened on that Friday afternoon? Right. I mean, that Friday morning after Thursday night. You got Black Friday. Mm hmm. Folks going broke behind this shit, man. The whole time you got a real organ that happened to act behind it. It wasn't folks going crazy over no half price TV. You was that half price TV. TV right. Yeah. Yeah. Like, uh, no child was, oh, sold for 30% off. You yeah. know what I'm saying? But they dressed up and make it look good. And, and they yuck for gun now. So they just like that picture they got. With all, it say Black Friday on it, but they were selling the slave. And they yep. tell you on the picture, say Black Friday. And they sit on a little auction, uh, auction yep. uh, table type shit. Like, it's just the point, man. Everything completely off, according to these people. But you had some on. Yeah, no, nah, that was it on it. But I'll just just to land back real quick. You know what I'm saying? With um, the opera saying, you know what I'm saying? That you know what I'm saying? That's why we. That's why I say don't eat, envy the oppressor, man. You know what I'm saying? You don't supposed to be envying that oppressor. Mm -hmm. And who's the oppressor? Like I said, Sleazy E, man. Esau, the so-called white man. That's why the people got to go break their necks and feel like they got to do this because you want a white Christmas like Esau. <laughs> you envy the oppressor right. so much that you're to the point you got to go buy the children out of toys and got to get present gifts and wrap them up like he do. But that's his holiday. Right. You know what I'm saying? He want to be like Yahweh by Shem Yahweh Shot. Yahweh got uh, with Holy Day. He got holiday. Right. And you breaking your necks to celebrate the holiday instead of the holy day. Right. You know what I'm saying? Like, like I said, it like it already, you know, already cut up already. The envy the person choose none of his way. He choose none right? of his way. He make, he start making you going further away from your house, about your house, shot, make you go, make you go against the lost touch commandments, right? Because on what things killing with niggas in town. Yeah, you know, all time. Niggas ain't booty no just, just like the um, so like nah, I, ahead, I was gonna say, just like um, the brother the, that count one count man that. Yep. Adults and eating the ham yep. on, on, on live. Oh, what else? Yeah. It was a, it was a brother that, you know, wearing yeah, friends seen, like the everything. old school looking yeah. cat. Yeah. He was sitting in the car. Yeah, yeah him. Talking about See, he don't. He even, oh, got, he with a cow. He even said, oh. Now, Shagun kill a lot of our people. 
Right. That's why he say two thirds got to die. Cause y'all just be spitting your hand by shooting outside. Like he's all, like he's all good. Like the Lord ain't gonna do nothing behind that. You know. But damn, he put a cap. Yeah. Oh, see, the Lord. Yeah, he had a little. Yeah, the Lord yeah. gonna get rid of that whole congregation, man. It was all Lord. You know what I'm saying? Cause he had it. When that first one, when they, they was like showing the food, yeah. you know what I'm saying? That incident, then he went to the car. Cause they were, you know what I'm saying? Some, he, didn't, he didn't see no video. Yeah, he got a video with Boot, you know what I'm saying? Mm. So he like, I don't give a damn, man. You know what I'm saying? I'm still going to, next time I'm going to go, I'm going to go even harder. You see what I'm saying? And that's, hey, that's what, that's what that scripture going into. It don't envy the oppressor. Right. And he object, and he supposed to be a man of the Lord. But right. he's sitting there you. envying the fucking oppressor. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> It, Crazy. You, you can run your back up to that song. This song is 106. I'll start, start making 33. Right. Because it says, because they provoked his spirit so that he spake unadvisedly with his lips. Same thing with us. That's what we got here doing. They provoke, hey, man, they provoke our spirit to the point. They fix our spirit. They know how the Lord wants us to operate. But then you look at our people, our family members and friends, they still participating in pagan holiday. They telling you, oh, you ain't gonna get that for your child for pre Hell no. For yeah, what? Right. I don't, that ain't in the Bible. That's not biblical. You know what I'm saying? And they look at you like you crazy, like you leaving your child ass out because you ain't buying them that. Right, right. You know what I'm saying? It's like, I know for myself, I know I'm going that shit. Come on, like, bro. hey, I'm gonna stand on that shit, man. How you gonna, you feel me? You know, either, you gonna respect what I got going on. Like, you know. I know one time they tried to goddamn. You know, this my daughter, you know what I'm saying? Uh, her birthday, he supposed to show up by a goddamn cake for him. I threw the whole shit in the trash can, like, bro, you ain't gonna do that. You know what I'm saying? Cause like, hey, the Lord can judge us by letting us see like that slide, man. You know? But this is the point, right? But back into it, Psalm 106 and 30 folks. It said they did not destroy the nations concerning whom the Lord Yahweh commanded them, but were mingled among the heathen and learned their works. Right. You can join down the third of um I mean, short down to 41. It says 41, and he gave them into the hand of the heathen, and they that hated them ruled over them. So, right, that's why we were given to the hands of the heathen. For so doing what? Idol worshiping and following the ways of the heathen. Right. Right? That's why we were given to the hands of the enemy. That's why your enemy ruled over you, because you never, we never wanted to obey the law that you commandments of your high by Shem Like mm -hmm. today, we, we celebrate Christmas. You right, like Sunday and Monday, everybody gonna be going in, ready to open prison, on route prison. Hey, matter of fact, I got a quick piece. Oh, go, well, come on, here. here's the book of Deuteronomy. Is it 14? Uh, or is it 15? What is it? Just the beginning of it, like you want to just like, hearken to the law, that's commandment. Oh, uh, 15 and what? 15, uh, 14 and 15. It says, but it shall come to pass if thou wilt not hearken to yes, the voice of the Lord Yahweh with thy power to observe and do all his commandments and his statutes which I command thee this day, that all these curses, curses shall come upon you, upon thee, and overtake thee. Right. And just, you know, case in point, like, you know, hey, we, we kept, we didn't want to listen, hearken to what, hey, our hope Father Moses had put on tablets for us. Also oppressed them, and they were brought into subjection, into subjection under their hands. Right, that part of the day he say the Lord gonna put the curses upon you. Right, that part of the curses. We were running tonight with Brother J. Ray, with us being up on the heathen. Lord giving us to the uh, giving us to the hands of the heathen with being in subjection upon them, right. learning their ways. Which now the Lord got the man's out here to send recruits throughout church to the point you ain't got to follow the man way. Now nah, the Lord got this light out here to the point. Hey, you want you should want to take heed to what the servants of the Lord are talking about out here when we on the corner, man. Like we're going to the pagan holiday. Matter of fact, we go back to um Jeremiah 10. Uh, uh, I'll take it. Oh, yeah, you already right. know. You already know. Huh? All right. Jeremiah 10, and I'm gonna go to three. Yeah. And it say, for the custom of the people are vain, right? And worthless. Like what like second what you chopping down a tree and setting it up. What you getting out of that? You decorate a tree, you setting it up. Who you praising and worshiping? You, you really idolizing a tree. And the man who set up, <laughs> and the man who gave you uh, the origin of the tree to be set up. 
You know, like that's why the Lord said it's vain, it's worthless. You serving a goddamn tree, man. <laughs> and yeah. it's a dead tree, and that, and that fact, cause you gonna cut the tree. Tree got life too. But when the tree um in the ground and rooted, what it do? It grow. Yeah. But you cut that tree, it ain't no. It, it, it start fall dead and leaves. You watching a dead tree, man. So everything just defiled with the man Peggy Holiday. What he be bringing out, right? Run that back ten and three. For the custom of the people are vain. For one cutting a tree, they say what? For one cutting a tree out the forest in the work of the hands of the workmen with the axe, right? As a matter of fact, I gotta uh show you the picture, right? This is how you know the Lord talking about Christmas in the Bible, right? Let me talk this in real quick. Watch this, cutting down a Christmas tree. <laughs> Watch me pop up. Let's show these folks, bro. They how real the Bible is. You know what I'm saying? You, you can't get around it. Like, the Lord telling you, don't follow the ways of these heathen, which he letting you know he saw even the white man. Because he's the only one come up with this taking holiday talking about a Christmas, a Christmas celebration, right? Um, ran three back. Ten and three, Jeremiah. It says, for the custom of the people are vain. For one cutting a tree out the forest, the work of the hands of the workmen with the axe. They say they deck it with silver and with gold. They fasten it with nails and with hammer that it move not. Right. And he said they deck it with silver and gold. Now, and I had a picture. If you were strong to the top of it, you see the tree decorated with what? Silver and gold. You know, all kind of ornaments on the tree. Right? That, that, that's right. That's Christmas the Lord talking about. So I remember saying, well, one time, uh, about it. Hanging from it, right? And then mm -hmm. that, you know, also, hey, we was the prisons as well. You know what I'm saying? Here you go, this, this, this three kids right here. You know what I'm saying? Like, you envy, like, you when he said, envy you know a person cheating on his ways, when you choose things, you don't even know the full the background of it, man. You just clinging on to it. Mm. All right, and I'm gonna read this right here. And this is a little something. JJ Brown got something real quick going to Christmas. It's a, they is, it's a, there is of, of course, a dark side to, it say, to Father Christmas, it say, as you might expect, and what would be Crumpus, who verily Santa's little evil helper, or his ancient enemy, whereas Santa rewards good children, it say, Crumpus played the bad cop to the, the big red guys, good cop, and punished bad kids, especially in areas of Eastern Europe. But it's just the point, it's just showing you that Christmas, man, plenty, it's a pagan, it's an off ass wicked holiday. All right, even you go on the deep history to tell you that if you go more into it, but that's just something to bring it out, just to let you know, man, this shit is all off. What y'all about to see me out with shot? When it comes to deceivers, right? Because it's no, it's no conspiracy. There's no, there's no point around it, right? You got Santa and Satan with the same exact character. Come on, the same character. Down to the same. It's spelled the same. Really? Santa, Satan. The last, you know, that was just back. Jay Yup, switched around. Ain't no way in the hell. Then it's talking about evil help. Then that's deceiving. What they're yep. doing, they deceiving what? You know, really, Israelites, man. So called Nicholas and Nathan, man. Right? Because it's for us to not adapt to. And it's and another thing, and it's so crazy. I don't do it, man. I'm the one of y'all got some y'all want to bring out. I just want to say this. And another thing is we tell our children not to lie, but we still are telling them 
we still a feeding Christmas to him. You lying to him, talking about Santa Claus bringing them goddamn Santa Claus bringing them toys and gifts and shit. But you telling them not to lie, but you teaching them to keep learning to lie. But why? why I got to well, I'm trying to figure out why would you want a pedophile and uh, your child is be sitting on a pedophile lap, man. Come on. The Esau is a pedophile, man. You know what I'm saying? But you got, you know what I'm saying, little Ricky, little Bobby. You know what I'm saying? All on Esau lap. You know what I'm saying? He all like, what, what, what you want for Christmas? But it's a damn lie, man. Cause he got smooth, buttery lies, man. God. You know what I'm saying? He a damn a uh, 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 pedophile to the uh, all the way to the fence, man. Yep. But y'all allow y'all kids to sit on. You know what I'm saying? This man lap, man. But why your child got sitting on a, a, a right. grown ass stranger lap just to say what he want for Christmas? Pushing that, they pushing that wicked vibration on the look. Huh, yeah. You know what I'm saying? That's not, that, we don't, ain't nobody sitting, man, who's, who doing that, man? Only, only them heathen, mystic ways, man. Yeah, I guess he's mad. Huh? All right, come, come. All right, I'm going to go to uh, Exodus 32 and 8. They have turned aside quickly out of the way which I commanded them they have made them a molten calf and have worshipped it and have sacrificed their unto and said, These be the gods, O Israel, which have brought thee up out of the land of Egypt. And we already know who brought us up out of the land of Egypt, man. It, ain't, it wasn't one of no other, other gods, man. It was Yahweh. He brought us up out of Egypt, man. It wasn't no other guys that's bringing up Israel out of Egypt. But see, that's what's wrong with Israel, man. They go into, they give you the oppression, man. You know what I'm saying? They, they going into them heathen ways, man. You know what I'm saying? So, at the same time, they, they, they still going to be going off, man, as they going off today, man. Worshiping Christmas. Doing heathenness the way. Nah, nah, I'm going to say, I just want to say we, that just show we, through all our history, man, from ancient time our way today, we always been worshiping idols, man. <laughs> we never get worship and praise and honor glory to Yahweh by Shem Yahweh It always go back. We doing all uh, idol worship, just like like they want a, a golden calf, man. Yahweh got your ass out of uh, Egypt through Moses. You know Yahweh by Shem Yahweh did that, but these niggas said, man, we need something to see. Just <laughs> right. like the tree. Uh -huh. We got to be able to see the tree. I want to be able to touch it and feel it and <laughs> decorate it and. Jay got it. Praise Israel worship. got it. This what I got. Israel, got Israel got to see something to believe it. You know what I'm saying? It don't matter what it is, man. Oh, I don't believe that, man, until I see it. That, that's what they, uh, Israel like to say, man. They got worse and worse sometimes. Yeah, worse Come. Yeah. Uh, this um, Proverbs 22 and 6, what, you know, one of what the brother was saying, right? You know, that, you know, you got you know, all of these holidays, right? And you would know the truth to it, right? They would know the truth to it. They still would teach their child a lot like a tooth fairy, man. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Something simple as that. You tell them folks, I'm, I'm the one that's doing that. You know that shit out, right? But you know, dispute on the point for uh, Christmas, right? We telling your people, we telling our people, right? No such things, no Santa Claus, man. And I think that old Saint Nick, right? They go back to Satan, man. It's like the definition, right? But uh, it says training for child, Proverbs 26, training for child in the way he should go, and when he is old, he will not depart from it. You know what I'm saying? So he's like, Hey, breaking those, breaking that chain early, man. You know, tell them it's not real. I'm the one that's doing all of this, man. All right? You go, you go to work all year for one day, then put all that, you know, reward on another, another man. He didn't chop the whole world in one night. Hmm. Kind of country ass shit, that, man. You know, but trying to tell them where they should go, man. Hey, let them know about who their power is, what our actual holy day is, man. right? So when they get older, hey, they, they don't, even if they were. Even though they would look like they being left out, they would not be left out, man. They know the truth. Nah, in, in, in a few minutes, the Lord finna, she get ready to scrape it up and, hey, kill the majority of people and, and deliver um, a little small ring. So they ain't losing out anyway. Those the one. Nah, go ahead. So, so I'm gonna say, hey, like I said, in Ezekiel 9 and 4, you know, and set a mark point on that side of the Right, because they're gonna be to the point. Hey, the church who, hey, you make it feel like they left out and their parents actually know the, the truth and believe in your high by Shemiah was shot. 
they're gonna be all right. But the one who keeps selling these pagan holiday, they the one gonna be asked out. They the one who's gonna get burnt in World War III. They not gonna make it during destruction, famine, and pestilence. When you how about you now shall bring it? And they not gonna get beaten up on the chariot. But the children who were left out, who everybody felt like they were left out in there, hey y'all, oh man, your parents, shit, they gonna be the one to make it on the ship. Yep. You know, Lord willing. But, yeah, we like Legend Declan in this movie. The weed in the tub. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? That's going up back to school. The weed in the tub. Yeah, the weed in the tub. You know I want to um, bring out the, uh, the definition of idolatry. You know, it says yeah. on Google, from Google, it says extreme admiration, right? And that admiration went to what? Praise, you know, respect. And that's what people do. They, they, they have a lot, they have a drive. something or some or someone right so kind and, and that main thing with um idolatry is a uh pleasure if you know, you're trying to, you're trying to, you know pleasure the flesh that's all you're doing right hey romans 8 and 5 may, may, may i grab that right quick but uh right because at the end of the day you're just pleasing the flesh that's it mm -hmm. uh that's an idea you or you can say, hey, your, your flesh is desiring the, to envy the oppressor. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. So really, <laughs> and that and that's what it is, man. Your flesh feel like, oh, well, that, hey, just like how we gonna get in the kingdom. It's something you got to do. Right, I, I got to I got to do this Christmas. Yeah, I got to do it this year. I got to make my ham, <laughs> my favorite ham, that yeah. that that ham that I always make every mm -hmm. year. Yeah. And that that's Israel, man, talking all that gang shit. You know what I'm saying? But ain't doing nothing but just being, hey, being a. Uh, uh, Adulterous or goddamn this fucking idol shit. You know what I'm saying? Idol worship. 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 That's it. That's all people do. Go ahead. Okay. Okay. It's like a sacrifice for your true nigga. That's a sacrifice. <laughs> That's it. You sacrificing, you sacrificing your, your motherfucking mm. light bills, Come. your bills Come. for a fucking tree. Come. <laughs> you really your, your for a dead ass tree. You really Artificial tree. Okay, you really throw your child inside the thing of Molech, man. Yeah. Molech, man. Ooh, that's God. all you're doing. Because it's like, they don't know no better. Right. You know what I'm saying? But if you don't, you know what I'm saying? If you don't tell them, of course they're going to think flesh. They don't know no better. Because you you causing your children to go out. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Whether you believe it or not, girl, you got them believing in that shit. And they won't praise it. They falling upon that, that, that spirit of that, that wicked ass vibration of supposed to be some shit that so called good, but really is, is wicked. You got them feeling like. They supposed to get presents and shit up on their day. So you you making them go off more than this you go off. Because they crying to you about the shit they want you going to get it. Because you got no believe in some false ass pagan holiday. Romans 8 and 5. It says, For they that are after the flesh do mind the things of the flesh. Mm. But they that are after the spirit, the things of the spirit. For to be carnally minded is death. Ooh. But to be spiritually minded is life and peace. And doing the things of Esau, Edom, all his holy, all his holiday and folly days are carnalistic things. Man. Yeah. Everything you know? got a wicked, some kind of wicked history behind it. Yeah. They just clean that shit up. But like, like, uh, uh, what's in February? Um, Valentine's Day. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? That shit got deep order. But you know, today, nah, go to school and get to your, your, yeah, your, your, your look, girlfriend, yeah. your boyfriend. You know what I'm saying? It's this shit is deep. Give it to it right. You know, hide, hide the eggs, you know, for, and this shit, man, it's deeper than that, man. I got a quick push up. This, uh, Exodus 20, verse 1. And Yahweh spake all these words, saying, I am the Lord thy power, which have brought thee out of the land of Egypt, out of the house of bondage. Right? Verse 3. Thou shalt have no other gods before me. Right? And that's really the point right there, you know? You should have no other God before me, right? And, and you going to what? Going after these uh, other idols, right? Nimrod and you know some stuff like that. That's this what those other God that you're worshiping, man. December, December twenty fifth. Nimrod, the sun, the sun God. The sun God, right? Yeah. That's a uh, 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 Tammuz. Uh, Seven radiance and Tammuz, man. Where you know what I'm saying? She was in a relationship with her son. You know what I'm saying? It's supposed to be like the sun God. You know what I'm saying? That was um. 
uh, Sunday going into yep, yep. worshiping the sun god. That's what, hey, man, he, this is a wicked as fuck. This man here got this. On one day out the year, hmm. it's supposed to be special for you and your kids. Shit, let Jake to that. They shit to January, in the January. Lights on outside and everything. Yup, yup. Jake's been <laughs> shit on January. Shit, shit. It's to the point, people worship it so much. Man, folks putting that shit up during Thanksgiving. Yup, yup. I seen that too. Shit, I seen it firsthand, goddamn. <laughs> shit. Being folks, you know what I'm saying? It's like, Fuck. and you tell them like, but yeah, y'all crashing out. You know what I'm saying? Y'all, y'all. Y'all, at least you're through. You're through, guys. Yeah, me, what? Hospital Gracie? Huh? Hospital Gracie? Oh, uh, Grady. Grady? Yeah, Grady, Grady up there. See, see, see. I ain't got a free sale, but you just said, but you just talking about the Grady image. Okay. But you, you done? I had one more. Oh, go ahead, go ahead. All right, this is um, Exodus 20, verse 5. It says, Thou shalt not bow down thyself to them, but serve them. Serve the fucking truth thing. My, Monday, Monday y'all will be serving the truth. <laughs> they will be all up on the criminal truth on rep and pray. Yep. Go ahead. It says, Thou shalt not bow down thyself to them, nor serve them. For I, the Lord Yahweh, thy God, am a jealous power. Ooh, the mm -hmm. Lord said he a jealous power. So with all the idol worshiping man, the Lord, the Lord see that. The Lord say he eyes upon the sinful, on um, the sinful king. Mm -hmm. So the Lord see everything you people do. You you can't hide from your high by some outside, right? The Lord see all the idol worship going on. That's why the Lord like I got to clean it. Two thirds, you got to go. Yeah, I got to make it desolate to the point you can't even stay here no more. Mm, stay here. That, that's how wicked it is, man. <laughs> you got to the point these folks worshiping these folks. Uh. Religion, so called religion, more than what they doing it, man. Yeah, right. Well, now nah, they look at them days. At least, at least the Edomites and the Edomites and got them afford to do it, man. I folk can't do this shit, right? Man. You know what I'm saying? Now you at work for the next week, talking about y'all show you ain't got no extra PTO. You know what I'm saying? Because <laughs> you trying to get your money back because you didn't got damn fib and brake lights that came, you know, engine lightning came on and all type of shit, mm -hmm. man. Mm -hmm. You know, because you didn't. Sacrifice your priorities over the kids and what they or what their little desires is. Oh, they look criminal. This is, you know, and backwards, man. It's too, we so backwards, man. Man, these adults serve the kids, man. Yep. Yeah. And truth say you're not no children. You don't need supposed to get your children no power over you. But the day, shit, nigga, for coming up with for December twenty fifth, y'all gonna get y'all children power over y'all. Yeah, they tell you. I want this, and y'all niggas crying yeah, about this. Don't go see it. <laughs> you tell, they tell you to shut the fuck up and get your credit yeah, card. Credit card. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> we ain't got time. We ain't got time for that, mama. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? You talk. It what you told us, and you finna make a hey, yeah. do of it. You know what I'm saying? She looking like, damn, yes sir. You know what I'm saying? Cause that, hey, that's what it is, man. Y'all don't. They crave it. They crave the. In, they crave this shit, man. Israel crave the envy, the pressure, man. They craving it, man. It's like a hunger for them, man. To be wicked, man. Yeah. They don't know no right. They ain't trying to know no right. I'm gonna land back off of what you were saying on um, pre self um, coming out. On um, this uh uh Leviticus 26 and 1. Ye shall make ye shall make you no idols, nor graven images, neither near so like a neither rear you up a standing image. Woo! 
Hey, that, what that, that Christmas tree, the right? Christmas tree. Standing image. Anything you can set. Just like shit. Anything you can set up and stand, bro. The cow. Yeah, like the cow. The cow. Stand up. Everything. All that. Fucking Christmas tree today. Shit. Hey, we, as soon as we get this right here. Ain't the idol they wear. <laughs> right. As soon as they're going to be, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> yeah. that, that's it. They're going to be worshiping that. Yeah. <laughs> come Because they're going to follow after the works of it. Yeah. Come on, come on. Neither rear you up and standing image. Neither shall ye set up any images mm. of stone mm. in your land to bow down unto it, for I am the Lord Yahweh, your God, man. This is what the God of Israel said, man. Not the God of other gods, man. The God of Israel, the God of your forefathers, Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob, man. Right. Put in that spirit of God damn the four brothers, man. The right. Three brothers. It's like <laughs> three brothers, man. Hey, we hear that. We ain't bound on none of that music. You know what I'm saying? Mm. We're not serving you. We just inside your captivity, that's it. Because mm -hmm. the other powers don't exist. They really don't. <laughs> All the other, that's why they, they, that's why, see, Israel got to understand. Yeah, how about by Shimei Abishai, Israel exists. They Israel like knew that. And some of them other nations, the nations know. yeah, I was definitely saying, I was definitely saying that some yeah. of the other nations, they knew that. That's why, and, and they knew that the Lord wasn't dealing with them. See, they understood that clearly back then. They, they, everybody knew that God was dealing with everybody. The nation, the, the heathen nation back then, and the Israelite, they understood the Lord was dealing with only the Israelite. That's why the other nation was setting up their own idols. That's why they were setting up shit with stones and right. all kind of idols made out of wood and stone back then. Right. The same way they did, they, cause they understand the Lord wasn't dealing with them. Shit, he, right. that's the God of Israel. Yeah. We gotta come yeah. on with our own. They just, they just like you know? with the uh, top hat people with the rain boots on, man. They go bumping their heads against the wall, against the stone, right? Man. Worshiping the stone guys, man. Yeah. But they say they the real ones. Hmm. Right. Don't even right. If you really, if you be worshiping y'all, yeah, right, you won't be worshiping no idols because it's it's saying it in the scripture, man. You because you you'll be worshiping the Lord. The Lord said you got worship in spirit and truth. Yeah. So, so I mean, you wouldn't even have to set up no kind of idol. You just believe and have faith and call on the name of you. How about some y'all shout the truth right. power? Right. You no. Know? What you had some? You stay had some? Uh, shit. I got some more. I got plenty. Mm -hmm. Go ahead. Uh, shit. I'm going to stay in uh, Leviticus 26 and 30. And I will destroy your high places and cut down your images and cast your carcasses upon the carcasses of your idols. Man, look at that, man. This is what Yahweh Bashim Yashat said he going to do, man. And he going to put this place in destruction, man. He going to, hey, it's going to be carcasses on top of carcasses on top of y'all idols, man. Hey, God, Lord said it. You know what I'm saying? This, hey, this is what the Lord say, man. This ain't what we say, man. You know what I'm saying? So, hey, he gonna put y'all carcasses on top of y'all idols, man. Man, it's a precept. Well, it's a scripture. Where he say he gonna have your body among <laughs> your, your slain bodies. Remember, your body gonna be laid out amongst your idols, upon your idols. <laughs> right. Gonna scatter your body among your idols and shit. The shit y'all worship. Lord gonna stretch you out. Oh, they what you wear? I'm gonna stretch you out for it. Ooh, what right. you say? Hey, the time of calamity ain't gonna cry to them Yep. God. Oh, oh. Oh, oh. Oh, oh. Yeah, let me bring that crease up out real quick. I'm going to say it. Yeah, you hold what you got. I'm going to let you finish. I just want to bring it up. Come on, come on, come on. All right. Did Jeremiah 31 and 5. I'm going to start from um, just to get straight to the point. Jeremiah 11. I'm going to just start from 11. And it say, Therefore thus say the Lord, Behold, I will bring evil upon them which they should not be able to escape and thought they should cry unto me, I will not hearken unto them. Then should the cities of Judah and the inhabitants of Jerusalem, you saw the tribe, you know the tribe, so-called Nick Rowe, Native Mary, right. Indian, so-called Tenor Spanish. Right. It say, Go and cry unto the God, to the powers, unto who they offer incense, but they should not save them at all in the time of their trouble. So your December the 25th gods ain't gonna be able to save you <laughs> in the time of um, trouble with y'all about shit. Right. Shot, go and bring that great destruction to the earth. Uh. Shit you worship December the 25th, when shit mm. get real, call on that. And see what it be, um, deliver you out of the hands of the um, the evils with y'all about shit. Y'all gonna bring upon the earth with his sword and left hand side, which Esau eat him. Right? Right. But you, you hey, and I was gonna say, uh, you know, Esau, man, he, he, you know, he want that, that snowy white Christmas, man. You know what I'm that saying? That's what Jake wants. <laughs> yeah, Jake wants it too. That white Christmas, man. But see, 
Hey, call hello, you how about shooting a shot that uh you how about shooting a shot gonna hey, make it rain, hopefully. Lord willing, rain on a parade, man. You know what I'm saying? Ain't gonna be no snowy white Christmas, man. It's gonna be a goddamn oh uh, uh, all hell. Yo ass gonna be fucked up going in and out the car and in and out the house. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Mad as hell cause your shit wet. You know what I'm saying? Lord willing, Lord willing, the goddamn lights go out. Come, woo. Tomorrow night. Come, come. Then what? The light go out then. What then? What? The prison gonna be shit. Then you gonna be trying to get right. It's gonna be too late. Right. Running no prison. Keep that goddamn keep warm. You gonna be trying to keep warm, snuggle up, but better hope y'all got them on Christmas sweaters on. You know, the ugly, the bit with the bells it's on. It's beginning to feel like like Christmas. <laughs> <laughs> right, hey, man. You know, what I'm hey. by the Lord, right? <laughs> and you irritate <laughs> like, well, y'all gotta, hey, y'all in the deep dip with your how about shit, y'all shit, right. all the high work. Right. You don't want to repent. The Lord got men out here, to, hey, to set proof out through the earth, so you can repent. As a matter of fact, like, like we did a video many back when we had a lot. We, we, we the hardest. Of all the prophets from, from all the ancient man. God. So we breaking it down to the T. We gonna be you know, letting you know directly who is your power is breaking the prophecies down. Letting you know the, the which way is the light. Right. We, we are the light, we got in you which way to, to salvation. Yep, man. Salvation. That's why the Lord said he's not gonna show no pity when the time of calamity, man. For what? Mm -hmm. I was you showing know, pity when I had the man's out here crying out. I show I, you know I, I spared you by letting you go sit down there at Rice Street, you know what I'm saying? You didn't win up after these Muslims. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And you came out, you know, and you started pressing after that. Then you came across the brother and you still started scoffing at it. Like the Lord was, you know, he was sparing, sparing you, man. But he also led you to that light to be like, all right, look, bro, you ain't no Muslim, bro. You Israelite. And you know what I'm saying? don't be one of goddamn. You know, so the time of calamity, man, hey, it's too late, right? Everybody been warned. Everybody been parked, man. What? Everybody. Right. I don't give a damn if you stop or not. You walk. If you walk by it, don't say he to be parked. You heard it. You hear me? Everybody. Yeah. Oh, not Ooh, right now, because they see you. Take that heat. Take heat. You got it. Shit. I, oh, just real quick. Yeah, you got it. Uh, just um, just real quick. Uh, Deuteronomy four and four and twenty three. Take heed unto yourselves, lest ye forget the covenant of the Lord Yahweh your God, which He made with you, and made you a great may make you a graven image, or the likeness of anything which the Lord Yahweh thy God had forbidden thee. So, hey, man, he forbid us. He forbid us be doing these heathenistic ways, man. We and what, uh, what, what, what Jake and Eve steady do, man. And what they say? I'm doing it for the kids. Doing yep. for the kids. Yep. Doing it for the well, kids. Anything. Man, we, just, we, we, just, we, just, well, we just get together just for the family. We ain't really selling. Yeah, 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 yeah. Doing for the kids. I'm doing it for the kids. Oh, wait, 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 we just get together for. We ain't really celebrating. What Mark say? I love the kids. Yeah. <laughs> kids on I love the kids. I love the kids. I love the kids. Two thirds that want to celebrate, you know, all these folly days, right? Mm -hmm. Christmas, Thanksgiving, Thanksgiving, all of that. You and your kids gonna die, man. Right. The worst way. But if you love your kids, you supposed to be teaching them the right way, man. Yep. And that's hey, through your how about shimmy out shot. Come on, you know what you're gonna teach them the right way. You're gonna teach hey, you gonna train up in the way that you right? Hey, when it says hey, even if they're first, you gonna train your child not to envy that way, man. Right. Don't desire that because hey, they going down, they going they going to slave. <laughs> you not. <Yep. laughs> you know what I'm saying? They gonna die when shit get real life. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> right. You not, so you might want to turn around before you get before you catch that. Double the judgment that they get, man. Right. And them Lord crank up. He said two thirds shall be cut off and die. Yeah. Yeah. There ain't gonna be no. There ain't be no goddamn quick. Oh, bullet to the head. Hell <laughs> no. 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 Get nibbled on by a goddamn squirrel to death. Probably some yeah, shit. The Lord gonna let a hell. Shit. Like, and a lot of them gonna die off of a suffering death. Like yeah. you gonna actually have to go. You, the Lord gonna actually let you niggas feel. Mm -hmm. But like I say, uh, a gunshot. Nah, that shit too quick, quick for a lot of y'all. Way too quick. You know yeah, what? Hey, and what's that? Lamentation four and nine. Right. They that be slain by the sword are better than they that be slain with hunger. You know what I'm saying? Look at how you gonna be in a, a real, wow, real fucked up, up state. Yeah. Yeah. To the point where you you gonna be crying to them other powers. Yeah. Right. You don't you, the Lord gonna leave you all um, in, in, in the confusion. Like you say, hey, they, ooh, what they should say? All oh, these niggas are idle shit going to confusion. You know, uh, y'all gonna go in the confusion like what the fuck? Then you gonna be trying to call on your um Jesus, but that y'all don't know the name. Yahweh and Yahweh Shaka, y'all don't right. wanna know the name. So they gonna go into a what? Uh they gonna go in a goddamn penny mode 
called no seizure right seizure boy Jill. Seizure right boy Jill. Jesus! <laughs> right. I'll go bring that uh limitation four and nine real quick. Con, you know what I'm saying? Con, con. Right this limitation four and nine. They they that be slain with the sword. What? They that be slain with the sword are better than they that be slain with hunger. So the Lord said it's better for a lot of y'all to die to get shot. The <laughs> goddamn right. blood to be to be starving. Shit, <laughs> but hey, get what the Lord gonna do. He gonna reverse that shit. I'll tell you what, nigga. A lot of y'all eat y'all. I'm gonna a lot of y'all for these eat y'all kids. Mm. Y'all gonna love them then? Right. <laughs> you gonna love your kids no then? No food. Eat right. your kids. Can't escape the evils that come. A lot of y'all gonna suffer like hell. Right. Jeff with whip. I ain't a worship. All because you want to yep. please your kids. Yep. You know what I'm saying? Man, that's crazy, man. That, that shit. That's why. Hey man, that's why they gotta be put to death, man. Two thirds of Israel, man. But the Lord, mm -hmm. shit, like, not, not, not good. Good. now I'm just like, the Lord made it simple. Shit, worship Him or die. <laughs> that's it, bro. Come back, worship me, give me honor, pray, worship me, salute mm -hmm. me, bow down to me. You know that was blessed going to. Yeah, nigga gave me a dollar, but I'm blessed. No man, bless mm -hmm. me to bow down to salute. Highly mm -hmm. What's up? You know. So, right, man, you, you should be coming back and blessing your how about shit y'all shot. Salute, ball down to your how about shit y'all shot, man, for the thing he do for you. You know? But you got it. Yeah, I got some. Yeah, I got some. Oh, I got some. Oh, I got some. I got some. Okay, go ahead. Yeah, I come right. This Amos, chapter 1, verse 1. Amos, chapter 1, verse 1. Amos, chapter 1, verse 1. Amos, chapter 5, and verse 21. Yeah. 21. It say, I hate. The Lord said he hate. But they say the Lord love everything and everybody. The Lord said he hates you. Missing the pipe out this Right. See, Amos chapter 5 and verse 21. Right. It said, I hate, I despise your feast days, mm -hmm. and I will not smell your solemn assembly. So, right, the Lord said he hate, he hate Christmas, he hate Thanksgiving, he hate Easter, he hate the 4th of June, he hate all these pagan holidays y'all got set up, man. Anything you can name, holo especially Halloween shit, nigga, that's a wicked holiday. Cancel that shit out. <laughs> <laughs> that's an evil day, nigga. Uh -huh. and, and Jake participated in everything. Everything. They participated everything. in everything. That's the first thing man. they put on. Something demonic. Yeah. Especially the women, they're putting on something looking like a devil or a witch. Yup, devil or witch. Come you on, man. It's, and it's at Solemn Assembly, man, right? We need to find the word Solemn, right? Go to, like, seriously, yep, yep. right? Deep in thought. Yep. And people take a lot of deep in thought when it comes to what? All of these holidays, right. especially Christmas, man. They're uh -huh. really thinking about going broke. <laughs> to the point they ain't even thinking about it. They're just doing it because of, they love the pleasure and seeing their child yep. smile, man. Right. And also with your, your celebration, right? Yeah. And also, Bag up that too. You know, the Lord, hey, let you look, give a little celebrating day like what y'all be doing. All the little big day y'all celebrate. Right? Uh, verse 22. Uh, well, I just read 22, I'm going down to 23. He said, Thought ye offered me burnt offering. Uh -huh. This is what going back to the ancient times. But everything's still going for today, even though we ain't got to sacrifice animals today. It just stay the point. Mm -hmm. You know? It say, Thought you offer me burnt offering and your meat offering, I will not accept them. You say, neither will I regard the peace offering or your fat beast, right? But they, like I said, when you're doing sacrifices, but when you start crying out and, and trying to um, call on your high by some shot of hip, you need time to trouble. The Lord not going to hear it. You know? It say, verse 23, take, it say, take thou away from me the noise of the songs. It's beginning to feel a lot like Christmas. <laughs> <laughs> Lord say, take the songs away, man. Take thou away from me the noise of the songs, for I will not hear the melody of the vow, but let judgment run down as waters, as righteousness as a mighty stream. Woo! And then we're going to get ready to do in this minute, man. Judgment going to run down yeah, as water. Like water. Goddamn that. And that shit constantly shit. flowing, nigga. No stopping. Hey, hey, all the way up to the horse's bright. Bright, man. Uh, man, come on. Especially when it rains, that shit coming full <laughs> throttle and all through the stream. That's how the Lord judgment me. Right be like, uh, that's real strong. Right, yeah. I gonna be like the days of Moses, man, when Ooh. it was raining. It was raining with blood. Yeah. Uh, what was that? Blood or it was raining? Something. Uh, it was red. Uh, oh, oh, when no, he turned the water to blood. Oh, uh, uh, yeah. Come, yeah. Come. Come. 
right in front of me. Jose chapter uh, 2 verse 11 it said I will also cause all her mercy to cease right it says in, in the title God, God judgment against Israel Yahweh judgment against Israel right and it says verse 11 on uh, Hosea 2 and 11 I will also cause her mercy to cease her feast days her new moons her Sabbath and all her solemn feasts right so but the day we living in the times of Esau even so and you move on the way, you learn the works of the heathen like we just read. Y'all learn the ways of the heathen. So the Lord going to what? He going to get rid of all your, because your Sabbath day is not, hey, going off the moon. Your Sabbath day, every goddamn Sabbath. That's your Sabbath. That's your feel. Well, really Sunday. Right, so like, really, Yeah, really Sunday. Y'all think that's the time when you're supposed to goddamn no, man. You're supposed to you go out the moon with the uh, Sabbath. But, hey, the Lord say, Y'all Sunday, y'all, cause y'all be Sunday worshiping. Y'all just, just all, all kind of worshiping. Worship. <laughs> they may they may go new worshiping. <laughs> <laughs> this is gonna be new worshiping day. Right. We're supposed to be in church for eight hours straight. <laughs> but eight, three hours. But talk, hey, but I ain't talking about I that. Heard, I don't hear two precepts. Two precepts. Not even precepts, really. Really, just scripture. It's <laughs> two different scriptures. And, and they're ready to eat their ham. Yeah. Right, and you know what they gonna do on that on, on Christmas. You know that everybody, oh, cause you know they love to go on the uh, church on New Year's. You know what I'm saying? That's their favorite spot. Halloween. <laughs> Halloween. Oh, we gonna go to church. You going to church? Why? Cause, cause it's New Year's. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, and the goddamn bullet gonna fall right through the church. Shit. So right. So y'all, so y'all goddamn savage. So y'all savage. Y'all six days. The Lord gonna get rid of all the um. Out of the, on the holy day, the day y'all put in front of you, how about you, y'all shot? What if you don't? Out of order, Lord, you get rid of all that. What do y'all got? Uh, this Deuteronomy 29 and 17. And ye have seen their abomination and their idols. Wood. You already know wood, the tree. That, that go in there too. They got tree wood. They, they, well, they got conquer. They make the. the the wood out of the tree. Right. And what they going to cut? Just like that, um, cutting the um, trees down, man. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Wood and stone, silver and gold, the ornaments. And you can say that. You know, y'all dig, hey, y'all dig it with silver and gold. Worship that too. You put it on the tree. I like this. <laughs> nice little ornament to put on the tree. Like it goes to doing the strong. Worship all uh, this shit in one. Mm -hmm. yeah, extreme mm -hmm. love. I got you, right? Extreme love. We're, we're among them. I'm gonna go with John 18. Least this, hey, they're going with all of them, all the uh, people. Least there should be among you men, our women, our family, our tribes, whose heart turneth away this day from the Lord Yahweh our God to go and serve the gods of, of these nations. Least there should be among you a root that bearer gal and wormwood. Well, that shit gonna lead to destruction. Right. Hey, I got a pre-sale too to bad it up. I right, call that rich. You got it. That's yeah, it. I'm just gonna this. I go exactly what you got. Now. Jeremiah 2 and 11. Have a nation changed their God with their power, <laughs> which are yet no powers, no gods, but my people have changed their glory Ooh. for that which does not profit. Right. Right. <laughs> that what you Israelite do. Y'all goddamn start worshiping these other idols. They can't deliver you. Y'all worship the other God, the heathens, and they idols, they can't save you, they can't deliver you. You change your, uh, your glory, that actually exists for somewhere don't exist. Just because you're fascinated by materialistic shit that come with it with these idols and you can basically with the other nations and they uh they believe you can do any basically you can do anything you want to do nah, you can, huh? That's it. Just, just back to what you were saying right only to like you know you should be certain different idols but let's write a book of second chronicles 15 verse 13 that whosoever will not seek the god of israel should be put to death whether small or great Whether man or woman. Like you said, to the point, like, like you said one time back uh one of the camp was talking about how what's the movie? The myth, the myth. 
Yeah. How the lady had the little scene when she was telling oh, someone yeah. one true power. That's the God of the Israelites. Nah, it's huh? the God of the Israelites. The God of the Israelites. You know? So, hey, we tell you, hey, if you're not trying to serve your high body, you're not to power the Israelites, right? Mm -hmm. We put it down. Not, not no fake ass Allah, not no okay. fake ass Buddha. Buddha. Sam Marita. Marita. <laughs> All that shit. Man, she be dead. Yeah, yeah. Hey, come. What, what she said? What the lady said? Stop be scared of church. She said they should be scared. <laughs> right. They precious little light should be scared. Mm -hmm. What, what, what y'all doing to them? Yeah. And then at that, when the Lord said, "Hey, I'm a, I'm a man. Of, I'm a man of war. Mm -hmm. He's I'm a jealous power." Right. So just imagine you got to. Uh, I see you doing some bullshit, and you mine, you my possession. Right. You, but you doing some foul shit. You really, you really fucking with a, another man. Yeah, really. Right. I'm gonna be jealous, and I'm gonna do something to you. Right. So I can take this shit. <laughs> <laughs> right. Jack your ass. Right. Hey, God, yeah, cause, man. Right. Cause the Lord, you know what I'm saying? We, hey, we the wife, he the husband, man. Right. You know, and like you say though. The bride's the, right. You know, and, and the wife get out of line, mm -hmm. and she, shit, the husband gonna got down. You feel me? The same thing. Well, yeah, how about some y'all shot? Cause what? He said we, we played a harlot. <laughs> we, we fucking everybody. Oh, uh, spiritually. Cheating on him with other religions and right. doctrines and right. shit, man. Doctrines and man, we laying over everybody. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. And that's the heart of the Babylon, man. Hey, this is the book of Colossians 2, verse 8. It says, Beware lest any man spoil you through philosophy and vain deceit, after the tradition of men, after the rudiments of the world, and not after Hamashiach Yahweh Shah. Right? I want to grab that contemporary uh, English Bible as well. Right? It says, see to it that nobody enslaves you with philosophy and foolish deception, which conform to human traditions and the mm. way the world thinks and acts rather than Yahweh Shah. Woo! You know? And so, in case in point, you right? That shit. You can't, right? Because that's foolish deception, man, right? You telling this man is coming to your house, his house, his house. Mm -hmm. Nigga across from California house all in the same night. You know what I'm saying? Right. Like the man believe you all the toys you want, this and that and the third, you know. Um, not even just you know <laughs> Christmas. You got Thanksgiving, all this all things the foods of philosophy, man, right? And these are traditions of men, man. Mm -hmm. You know? I'll read about one more time if y'all got something else. Come. I got something to bring. You can read that and I'm bring something. Okay. It says Colossians 2 and 8 in the contemporary English Bible. It says, see to it that nobody enslaves you which for with philosophy and fruit deception. Matter of fact, going back to what? Uh, 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 pretty much, um, dang, what, ah, damn. Choose, what is that? And choose none of his ways? What, what that precept is? And choose none of his, I can't think on top of my head. Damn. Uh, what it, what it will, now what you said? I'm in the part that said, and choose none of his ways. Oh, yeah, con. And we not know a person choose none of his ways. Yeah, con. <laughs> you know? Because hey, it's to enslave you in the mind, man. Yeah. You know? Hey, call her law, you're out like you know what's up. And we wake up, you know? We was enslaved to that, man. Right. To that philosophy, man. Right? And it goes into philosophy, really goes to like wisdom, like yeah. really this world. Yeah. And you know, that's the foolish with you. How about you know what's up? Um, this uh, first chronicle, this first chronicle, 16 to 26, for all the gods. Of the people are idols. Mm. Mm. So uh, hey, that's that's man point blank, man point blank, man. Cut right now. <laughs> hey, to the point. You can't even get the words. So <laughs> right, hey. you know what I'm saying. He said <laughs> all the guys. That means <laughs> all the guys. It, just like he said in the um, he said, hey, ain't nobody else in heaven with me. Mm. I'm the only one in in heaven. Matter of fact, like he said in Deuteronomy 28, was it no 32 and 39? See now that I am he, yeah, okay. there's no blood with, with me. me. Right. You know, yeah. Case in point, anybody up here doing what I'm doing? Right. Matter of fact, it's gonna matter of fact, it's gonna go right into what you just said. Uh, I'm gonna read it back. For all the gods are, for all the gods of the people are idols, mm -hmm. but the Lord Yahweh made the heavens. Woo. There you go, right there, man. You know what I'm saying? Straight cut. You know what I'm saying? He made, hey, yeah, how about you? I shot. He made the heavens, man. So they just show you how the other idol guy made nip. nothing. So why you worshiping? Why are you doing? Why are you envying? <laughs> I got to get y'all ass slave. Uh, slave, hey. How you doing? Matter of fact, um, you got a quick piece of it. Come, come, come. Matter of fact, I get it up to Jeremiah right here. It's Jeremiah 4 and 22, the infamous. <laughs> <laughs> it says, when well, my people is foolish, 
They have not known me. They are sadists too, too. right? Meaning to be mm. stupid. It says, they and they that have me, it's like everything time. For my people is foolish. They have not known me. They are sadist children. And they have none understanding. They are wise to do evil, but to do good they have no knowledge. Right? Because a lot, they kept going further. Once it's Isaiah 1 and 3, they're going back further and back. You know, they, they keep letting each other think you, right? You know? So they wild to sit here. Oh, you get the booty movie chillings. You get the ham. I got the pork chop. You know what I'm saying? They, they wise through that, man. Yeah. Right? When it comes to, hey, you get the lamb. Right. You, you get the oil. You know, right. the oil for, 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 uh, right? You get, you get the anointment oil for the, for the Passover, right? Yeah. They, not, they, don't, they can't do that, man. You know? So they, and they wise to do good, but to, they wise to do evil, but to do good, they have no knowledge, man. Right? And anything outside of this. <laughs> What the Lord has prescribed us with, the law, such commandments, the wisdom, right, right. of the Bible. Hey, that's considered uh what? Huh? Oh, Oh. Let me have a brain for it. Thank you. I forgot what I said. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I got I mean, see, you remember, I can bring this out while you, you know what I'm saying? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. See, this uh Second Chronicles 24 and 18. And they left the house of the Lord, Yahweh, God of their fathers, and served, rode, and idols. And wrath came upon Ju Judah and Jerusalem, the 12 tribes of Israel. For the for this they're transpassed. So hey man, Israel been going the hell out, man, since the biblical days. I'm not out there. Oh yeah. Wait, uh, what's second you? Chronicles 24 and 18. Oh, yeah. And hey, Israel been going out like hell, man. You know what I'm saying? They been going out, man. They love hey, I I man, Israel love wickedness, man. They love going out, man. It's something about going out. That make them feel good, man. Easy. <laughs> yeah, easy. You ain't got that. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> right like Neha. Look at Spencer, man. Uh, 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 I know, I know what you're talking about. You know what I'm talking about. Uh, uh, man, I can't uh, quote it, but I know what you're talking about. Yeah. Damn. 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 You got it out. <laughs> you got it out. You go ahead. You better take it. You burn it out. Yeah, that was it. Right, I got something. This Isaiah chapter 45. And I'm going to start with verse 15. He right. say, Verily, he say, Thou art a Yahweh that hidest thyself, O Yahweh of Israel, the Savior. He say, They should be ashamed and also confounded. All of them, they should go to, should like you, all of them, they should go to confusion together. <laughs> they are makers of idols. Right? So the Lord say, Wait, all these, y'all going to go into confusion. All these nations. Especially these nations anyway, because mm -hmm. some of them they still be trying to call on this man. But they don't want confusion anyway, because they got their own idols. The shit they believe in, they got their faith and hope in. When the shit get real, they gonna call on that and they gonna want to confuse like, well damn, what boo that? <laughs> you know all the other guy like damn what what say 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 that? Y'all gonna call they gonna call on all these fake God and they ain't not gonna be able to deliver them. <laughs> that chicken girl, right? Mm -hmm. That shit hit a nigga show. But if you read the rest of it, it's saying how the Lord basically on you know Israel is going to be saved, but I'm going to jump down to 20, verse 20. It say, it say, assemble yourselves and come down, draw near together. Ye that are escaped of the nations, they have no knowledge that set up wood, that set up the wood of the graven images mm. and pray unto a God that cannot <laughs> save. So right. y'all pray to all these powers that cannot save. Because you worship the gripping tree, you send the to the field. That don't mean that goddamn heart of God going to save you when it get real out here. He ain't gonna be nowhere to be found. Cause why? He don't exist. <laughs> the damn truth ain't gonna save you. And season right boys, this show ain't gonna save you. Yeah, he ain't gonna save you. Right? Yeah, he, he, hey, the Lord said, hey, who gonna save you out his hands? Right, cause right, you. Right, that's your house shot name. Right. He said he delivered. Yeah. Woo. Con, that's uh. con. <laughs> right? Hey, that, in case in point, going back to what? Back in Egypt. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Right. If, 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 if Pharaoh, you know what I'm saying, if they God was so real, 
Well, see, yeah, when you have a shot, coming through, making it smooth. Uh. <laughs> you know, it would have been a fight against a fight. You know, mm -hmm. it power against power. But yeah. now, uh, you know, uh. shot came through slanging shit. Yeah. He, hey, Pharaoh crying his ass. Yeah. What do you say? Yeah. Uh, crying eyeballs out. Hey, they go back to Daniel. <laughs> and Nebuchadnezzar, what do you say? Oh, he got, like, nigga, Daniel got a real. Right. When he got down, let him out. Like, oh, yeah. Hey, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Oh, they go off for real for sure. Hey, that, everybody done seen him. Everybody done seen the fear of your how about Shit, he know what's going on. He even said shit, nigga, thank God, real. You know? He knew, he knew, he knew exactly what y'all went in there. You know what I'm saying? Came out. Came out. Like, you know, ain't fuck with him? Yeah, you him. Right. Like, who the fuck said that? Who are y'all all in? Put y'all hands in there. Yeah, get your ass up in there. Even with all Misha and Shari and Abednego, man. Yeah. Mm -hmm. God. They came out, they came out like, what? Hell no. Nah. Hell no. Nah. When we see that, it's blazing. Yeah. The dude I, put, I told him to put in there, he died. <laughs> <laughs> so, you right, know, they thought so that called. So, that they show you, dude, they power don't exist. The ones who got turned around and, oh, you try to frame him up for this. All right, now we're going to put y'all in there. And mm -hmm. they got the scrub. But the man's of the Lord, they could why that God exists. They show, right. they probably all oh, try to call them. They look God, that shit, they need help. You got eight up, bro, whatever, whatever the case might be. You say, I, I, I haven't seen no gods prevail in the scriptures. Ain't no gods. Right. And I, I don't see no gods. All the gods are just basic bullshit. Yeah, really? You know really? what I'm saying? Something to kill time. Woo. <laughs> I got some more on it. <laughs> <laughs> right. Right. <laughs> 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 kill time, right. Reed, Reed's opened up the avenue for us, man. Mm -hmm. you, know, you know, to get us, a, you know, I ain't gonna say a guaranteed seat, but you know, the chances are pretty high. Uh, yeah, you right. Know? Say it's like a, a Willy Wonka and a uh, that golden yeah. ticket. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> Trying to get that golden ticket. You know. I got some more. Isaiah, chapter twenty-two, verse twenty-one. It said, "Tell ye and bring them near. Yea, let them take counsel together, who have declared this from ancient time." Who have told it from that time? Have not I the Lord Yahweh? And there is no Yah, there is no other power. There is no other Yahweh. There is no mm -hmm. other God else beside me. A just power Yahweh mm -hmm. and a Savior. That is none beside me. Woo! But it's just to the point the Lord saying there's none beside him. Like he, he, I said once, earlier, a, once again, it's just huh? hey, keep a hey, precept by precept, line by line. Verse twenty-two. It say, "Look, it say, look unto me and be ye saved, all the ends of the earth." Hmm. For I am Yahweh. There's nothing else. Mm. <laughs> See, the Lord said he Yahweh by some Yahweh side, man. Ain't there nothing else. Ain't there never Yahweh by some Yahweh side. Who else? <laughs> nothing else can save you, man. <laughs> I, right. got some, uh, I got some left. Okay. Uh, matter of fact, this uh, uh, Isaiah 46, let me see, in verse 5, idols of power. Ooh, did the title say idols of power on powerless? <laughs> mm. Right? It say verse 5. To who will ye like? So like it say, to who will ye liken me? <clears throat> he make me equal. Ooh. <laughs> hey, the Lord be popping, man. Boasting right there. He said, who you like? You know. who, 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 who will liken it to me, bro? Come on, man. Well, like, what, what else can you make out there like me, equal to, equal to me? Right. You can't. It ain't nothing else out there. Right. Right. It say, to who will you liken me and make me equal and compare me that we might be a, that we might be like? Damn. It say. They lavish gold out of the bag and waste silver in the balance and hire a goldsmith and he make it a god. <laughs> so they go get these, anything god. Right, they go get say. Say they go get these workers, right? <laughs> these goldsmith, they go get these man who know how to fashion no idols out of gold and silver mm. and build it up and give them something to worship. You know what I'm saying? To the point, like, they don't, man, like, everything is an idol. You got to worship your house by some y'all side, spirit and truth. Ooh. I got free so You got on that. Oh, what you just saying? You come on with uh, me. This, this Psalms one, this Psalms are uh, one fifteen and four. Their idols are silver and gold, the works of men's hands. You know what I'm saying? There you go, right there. This is the works of men's hands. You know what I'm saying? Everything that y'all worshiping and all y'all idols y'all worshiping is the works of men's hands, man. They go higher gold smell. Right, come on. That's it on it. Uh huh. It say they lavish gold out of the bag. It say and weigh silver in the balance and hire a goldsmith and he make it a god. <laughs> right, they fall did. down, yay, they worship. It's they fall down, they worship. 
Like, nigga, you've been mm. hustling. I'm like, they crib a tree. <laughs> right. Think about it, you finna go mm. bow down on the tree. What they do? Right. Do that, they get down upon the tree, get on their knees Ooh, and everything. Uh, Start hey, open up the, Hey, what the kids running, running up, slide on their yep. knees. Knees you know back saying? Saying? <laughs> You know what I'm saying? They all on their knees, opening the gifts and shit. Oh, you know what I'm saying? Hey, uh, uh, y'all grown ass motherfuckers be doing the same thing too, yeah. running under the on tree. tree. You know what I'm right. saying? Oh, bending down, bending down up on the tree. Ho ho <laughs> hopefully that your um beta male got you something that you really yeah. wanted, it, man. Uh -huh. You know how y'all beta males, y'all gonna get anything, mm. you know, <laughs> anything that Eve asked you for. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Oh, give me a, a diamond. Yeah, you, you broke as hell, man. But yeah. you, you, you trying to get yeah. your last. You gonna sacrifice for that Christmas? You sacrifice for that tree. Ooh, uh. <laughs> you had to make that sacrifice for, for that, that tree. tree. Ooh, uh. Let me got that. Damn, I gotta go spend my three racks. Right. 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 Hey, you got a nigga bill, dude. I gotta go get the kids a PlayStation Five. five. You know what I'm saying? Shit. Goddamn, they gonna go be get crying out to spend that money. <laughs> right. You gonna be crying, and then what? That net, that New Year come, the so-called New Year come. You know what I'm saying? Y'all gonna be like, damn, man. Now that y'all gonna be talking about what y'all gonna do for y'all a new re New Year resolution, man. Hey, okay, you know, on top of that, they they go they crash out on the twenty fifth, and five more days you got the first coming up. <laughs> now y'all here looking stupid. stupid. You know what the channel got the uh, line hey, what, uh, uh, your uh, first of the uh, month. That's, that's bill do. Yeah. Bills to do, man. What y'all gonna do? Did you let me kids trick your ass <laughs> and find all that and your, uh, your significant other. Right, come. Huh. Everybody, you know what I'm you, you, everybody wants something. <laughs> everybody wants something. You got a lot of kids and you got a wife and a lot of kids, man. Shit, you, man, you gotta it, buy it, Especially if, if they into the, the Christmas spirit, you know what I'm saying, where they families, they all on, on Facebook, IG. Oh, look what I got. You know what I'm saying? Oh, look what I got. That's what. You know what I'm saying? Israel want to do promote they silver. Well, look what I got. You know what I'm saying? Uh, hey, y'all got number idol gods. I ain't hot today. Right. Shit, how today, so. <laughs> Shit. Well, hey. <laughs> yeah, I'm all right. Crap. Shit. So when that goddamn bill collector talking about got the lights got to come off. You looking like damn well I want to get in that well, I, I had to make the to sacrifice. Yeah. That I had was, to sacrifice to the tree. That what you gonna tell your kids? Oh, why I like, why we can't get in, why we can't use the mic? Oh, cause, hey, shit, you wanted that goddamn Spectre Gadget toy. You know what I'm saying? You wanted that iPhone. You, you know what I'm saying? I had to make the sacrifice right. just for you, son, to the tree. <laughs> right. They say, can't you charge the iPhone or play the PlayStation 5 because you ain't got no damn lights. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So, hey, that's what y'all want to worship. Go ahead. Be, the, be my guest. Verse 7. Oh you, oh, you still read? No, go ahead. Oh, okay. okay. Verse 7. They bear him up. They bear, it's like they bear him upon the shoulder. They carry him. They set him in his place. That's just like a tree. Pick that motherfucker up. Coming out the farm with it. Got it up on their shoulder. Like a lumber jacket and shit. Right. They carry it. They set it up in their place. Shalom, shalom. 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 The same thing. Shit with all these man-made items. With the little statues you see. They pick it up. They got to carry and put it up. That's just like when he church and create an idol. Church, they building stuff. They got it. Somebody got to pick that idol up and set that shit mm -hmm. in the place outside. Mm -hmm. Same thing, man. They say they bear him upon the shoulder. Yeah, they bear him upon that shoulder. They carry him and set him in his place. They say he standeth for his place should he not remove. <laughs> yea, one should cry unto him, yet can he not answer. Mm. <laughs> they say, yet can he not answer nor save him out of his trouble. Right. Remember this and shoot yourself, men, bringing again to mind. Oh, you transgressors. <laughs> Remember the former things of old, for I am Yahweh, and there is none else. He keeps saying it. I am Yahweh, and there is none like me. Woo. That Lord keep telling me, fuck this Tell shit, bro. Y'all keep going to all these idol worship. That's, 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 that's the sin. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. on the law, First John three and four. Lord keep telling me, man. I keep telling y'all, bro. I got the prophets out here. Mm -hmm. Man, you got brother on the week going out the weekend, got him on the weekday, they got him. Man, cash. personally keep telling y'all about the idol worshiping, all these face guard, y'all still like in the Lord, that's why he said, Oh, you train, yeah, I don't see anything. You gotta pick this bitch up, you gotta carry him, you gotta set it up there. Ain't nothing like God damn, like y'all still can't get it. Right. I tell that's you. What say, Adam, shame shall know it's death by yep. pain. That's how they it's gonna get it. Yep. Yep. You don't know it's death by pain. Well, I tell you what, nigga. I'm gonna bring the death by pain to your way. I'm gonna say you're gonna save plenty pain. Right. But, yeah, what do y'all got to yeah, I'll just um, say, hey, Yahweh, man. man, you know what I'm saying? He set y'all up anyway, man. Like a, in, like in a trap, like a rat. You know what I'm saying? Let me uh, go to Psalms 106. 
and 36. And they served their idols, which were a snare unto them. So, hey, man, a snare is like a, a snare is like a trap, man. So, yeah, how about Shimei Hashem? That's a snare, man, when you go in and worship an idol. Yeah, that's like a, 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 snare, a snare is a trap, man. Right. And, and I'm going to read that back. This song's 106 and 36. And they served their idols, which were a snare unto them, man. Ooh. So, hey, y'all about shit outside. Hey, he, he warning you, man. He, he through the, you know what I'm saying? He going through the prophets, man. Let y'all know, man, mm. that y'all falling into a, a, a trap, man. Y'all worshiping uh, the pagan holidays. Like it's gonna get y'all somewhere, man. It's not gonna get y'all nowhere, man. But goddamn death and destruction, man. Okay. Death and destruction. See, like, you know what I'm saying? Hey, that's idol worshiping, man. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? These, these, these folks, you know what I'm saying, with the old school, yeah. you know what I'm saying? They idol worship because they, hey, they, I bet you, you, bet, I bet you can't they, touch that car. All, yeah, they put all their time in. Come on, yeah, money. They, yeah, yeah man. I bro. bet you, you can't touch that car. That's like, I think last, no, last year when we was out here, man, he had, he had niggas still riding around the sling shop. It was cold as hell out here. Right, you know what I'm saying? Because that whole shit, that, a whole <laughs> go-kart. Right. Because right. you worship it. You, you're an idol worshiper. You're broke behind that shit. Right. <laughs> an idol worshiper, man. And that's what, that's what, you know what I'm saying? Here's what it is today, man. Idol worshipers, man. They don't give a damn what. They, it don't matter, man. They, hey, they were worshiping the Popeye's chicken, man. Got some. Right. Right. Oh, let me get this real quick. Oh, right. go ahead. Right. 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 It's uh, Isaiah 19 and 1. Oh, yeah. The burden of Egypt. Behold, the Lord Yahweh rideth upon a swift cloud. You know the chariots. And shall come into Egypt, and the idols of Egypt shall be moved at his presence, and the heart of Egypt shall melt in the midst of it, man. And that's what's gonna be this, that, this is spiritual Egypt right here. Yeah. And this place is gonna be just like that, man. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> right, you know what I'm saying? Hey, he gonna come, hey, he said he gonna come in, in a, with a swift cloud, man. And that's the chariots of the Most High, man. Yeah, how about you? He gonna come down with it in a swift cloud, man, and put destruction on this earth, man. Mm. Okay? Yeah, hey. Reward, man. Right. Reward or bad reward, it don't matter. Hey, you gonna, you gonna get what you're coming to. It don't matter. Everybody, right now, everybody, right now, everybody's reaping, you know what I'm saying? Reaping, no, sowing for what they shall reap. Uh, yeah, reap re, re what they sow. Huh, you know what I'm saying? So we trying to sow for what? Salvation, you know what I'm right. saying? Hey, huh. you, you got two pairs, one of the <laughs> you know, put that, they, 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 they works into uh, uh, man hands. Man, they're going to fall. You know? So, hey, they're going to reap correction, right? Because we already know Esau got to fall. Right. You're right. That's why I said that. It's not, uh, was it, I, I think it is in Isaiah 30, 31. You know? Mm -hmm. Those that trust in the shadow of Egypt, you yeah. know what I'm saying? Right. Time, but that's that on that. Huh? Oh, that's it on it. Mm -hmm. All right. And I ain't going to All right. Shalom, on, man. We the Hebrew Israelites. We call weekend and week out the prophet side and down for our America. We call lost sheep of Israel. So with all that, we want to give our praise and honor and glory to Yahweh, Bashim, Yahushua, Bashim, Kagadash. Double honor and blessing to the elders, the apostle, great millstone. The water Yahweh, Bashim, Yahushua, for the elders, the apostle, on down for working us up to the woods, not true for understanding. Through the spirit, power Yahweh, Bashim, Yahushua. Shalom on to the few Akimim brothers who are doing their truth and sit across the folk on the earth, wherever you might be. Scout abroad along with the confusion of faces look like the other nation. Shout out to you, I go out with these well, being the sisters. We're going to to come back to the Al Bashim Al Shai as well. And with that, we're going to say Shalom. Shalom. Hope it will edify. Shalom.